Good morning. All right, so here's the deal. I gotta pay $700 just to get my car back. I did record the entire conversation from calling the police to report that my car was stolen to wondering why my car was stolen and where my stuff is. So, apparently, you got to pay money to get your car back from being stolen. So, I set up an agreement to pay $350 this week, $350 next week. That should be that. Which is fine by me because that's plenty of money for me to work with. $350 this week, that leaves me with $400 left. $400 that I can be using to save up for rent. So, all in all, it's just a really shitty situation from a really shitty company. Just literally lied to me. Whatever. I'm going to get my stuff back next Friday because I'm not giving anybody my key. The place that apparently has my belongings is charging me $75 just to get my stuff back. $75. There's nothing in that car that's worth $75. I'll just get it next week because they want me to bring my key. I'm not bringing... I'm not... I'm not taking my fucking key to them just so they could just kick me out and sell my car right behind me anybody want this car we got the key three thousand dollars guy owes four thousand or so fucking dollars I have the fucking I have everything recorded but I'm not going to upload anything to YouTube for legal reasons one, I don't want anybody to know what the, this fucking uh, this fucking company is doing. Don't want anybody harassed, even though I ought to harass them for taking my fucking car. Number two, they record me, I record them. So now I have a recording of them filled of filled with an empty promise of if you don't pay this amount of money your car could be sold in an auction. Hopefully this time I won't, won't have to wait a month. No, I know for sure next week $350 will be there. Nothing else is holding me back. Nothing. Literally just ruined my day. Ruined my week. It was a very nice day this entire week. And the one day that is 50 degrees outside, they decide, uh, uh, it's the day that everybody decides to screw me. Two weeks before my birthday. Happy birthday. Your car is mine now. Unbelievable. They wouldn't even explain why they took my car. They just gave me an outrageous fucking fine. Or an outrageous debt or whatever. $4,000 debt. Even though I set up to pay $200 for the first two weeks of every month, an automatic payment. It 
So it turns out that they don't do, they don't, or the, they either didn't want to do an automatic payment after all and just decided not to tell me. And I guess that's why they've been harassing me since November. Or whatever. At this point, take my fucking car from me. So now what? I'm just going to have to wait till next Friday. That's what I'll do. On the brighter side, at least my car will be cleaned out. It's all pretty messy in there. A lot of trash. And I, I've just I've been meaning to clean it out since last weekend. Since it was really nice out last weekend. I just meant to clean it out. But it's just not going to happen now. I can't. Don't have my car back. I don't have my car, period. How am I going to get to work? How am I supposed to get to work? Uber? I don't even have Uber installed on my fucking phone. I can do it real quick, though. Uber. installed really fast so uber how long does it take of course it takes a minute just to install but it takes five minutes to open oh there we go That's not work. That's not what where I work. How do I hold on? Five fucking dollars. Five dollars just to get to work today. Probably for all week this week. Five minute drive just to get to this place. Just to get to work. Hmm. All right. Well, it's I guess it's better than telling my parents. Well, I'm gonna need another fucking ride or something because I I don't have I don't have the car anymore. I'll probably keep them out of the loop for now. They don't need to know that my car's been taken away again. So, whatever. At the end of the day, I'll, I'll get my car back, but unfortunately, I'm probably not gonna be able to get my tire fixed. So, there's that. Probably get it fixed on my birthday. Who knows? Who fucking knows? Since people want to just fucking screw with me, why the fuck not? You know. 
I mean, it's not like I'm trying to save up for rent or anything. I try to get fucking March's rent out of the way, and then hopefully by April, you know, get something for the channel. Like, oh, I don't know, brand new Oculus Rift or a PlayStation 4 so I can play my fucking game that I have for it. Whatever. It doesn't matter. I don't have time for this. I just don't. So have a good day.